man it is uh it is cold it is cold today very very cold and it's rainy and it's wet and it's just it's just nasty conditions but we still got to go fishing so uh today that's what i want to go over i want to cover uh, a few things to keep you warm keep you dry and well keep you on the water Well, it seems like winter is finally here. Uh, the temperatures are, uh, they have dropped and it seems like they're staying. Now I know over the last few weeks, even the last you know month or two, we have been fighting it where it got into really, really cold temperatures and literally the next day it'd be back up to, to the 70s, uh, which, you know, is a little bit hard to plan for, but winter is finally here. It is, uh, it is cold. It's probably going to stay cold for a while and you know today we are going to go over uh, a few things that you can do to keep yourself warm keep yourself dry in all of these nasty conditions now texas we just have a uh, different kind of cold a different kind of winter than well most of the rest of the united states uh the humidity is still here when the cold fronts come down it brings a lot of wind it brings a lot of rain and you know because of that when it drops into the 30s it can feel a lot colder than it really is it can feel like it's in the 20s and that can be just nasty and miserable now a lot of people try to layer up with just tons and tons of layers to stay warm and stay dry uh, they'll wear you know multiple shirts and then multiple sweaters on top of that and you know a few pairs of pants and a few pairs of socks just trying to layer up as much as they can but uh, that can be really uncomfortable when you're fishing. You don't want to be, you know, just stiff when you're fishing. You still want to be comfortable. And you don't have to do that. You don't have to layer up if you have the right gear, if you have the right clothing on. You don't need all of those layers. You don't need that. So today I am going to go over um, a few of those pieces of gear and some of that apparel that is going to keep you warm and keep you dry without having to layer up so much. Uh, now I am going to be talking about Grundens. Uh, because I am associated with Grundens, you guys know that. Um, and I know that there are a few other companies that make really good dry uh, cold weather gear, uh, but I can't speak for them because I don't have them. I don't have that stuff. I do have Grundens, so I'm going to talk about that. Now, here in Texas, when the temperatures do drop, they give, it, it does get really cold, but that's generally not what we're fighting. That's not uh, what makes you miserable and cold on the water. It's the other conditions. It's the wind, it's the rain, it's the moisture, it's the humidity, it's all of that stuff that's what makes you cold. Uh, the temperature definitely, you know, plays a, a huge factor in that, but if you can keep the wind and keep yourself dry, you're gonna stay a lot warmer and stay a lot more comfortable. Uh, now, rather than layering up in a lot of different uh, sweaters and shirts and all of that other stuff, you can just get the right gear and it works better. It works for you like this. This is the uh, Grundon Gambler jacket. It is completely waterproof. It is Gore-Tex. Um, so I can wear this all day in rain. I can, you know, even when you're wading and you jump in the water, you can dip your arm in this because it has neoprene sleeves underneath it completely. You're gonna stay dry. You're gonna stay completely, completely dry in this. It closes up so I can also cover my face, velcroed, just like that. So yeah, you can keep your face uh, warm. You can keep completely dry. But uh, the biggest thing that I like about this is that it keeps the wind off of me. I can be traveling in a boat and I don't fin feel that wind chill like a lot of people do, they, where it just cuts through cotton and a lot of those things. It's, it, it absolutely keeps all of that uh, wind and that, that air temperature just off of you. So if you, you know, have some layers underneath, maybe wear one sweater or a shirt underneath, you're still gonna stay warm because you're going to stay dry and you're gonna keep that wind off of you and that's what matters. But um, that doesn't really help for your, your legs. Um, you're still getting that wind chill and all of that on your on on your legs. It's going to go right through most pairs of pants. So if that's the case and you want to keep your uh, legs and your body warm, well, you can uh, use these. These are Grundon's bibs, and you just slide them uh, over the rest of your clothes. Uh, so you still have the layers below you're going to stay warm it's going to keep you dry these are also gore-tex they are going to keep you uh, keep that wind off of you it's going to keep you dry you don't have to worry about rain or mist from the boats or any of that stuff um here i'm just gonna i'm gonna throw them on
Uh, yeah, so here they are. We got some bibs. Staying dry. And then we'll put my jacket right back on top because it is pretty chilly out here. Now, one last thing uh, about this gambler jacket and the reason that I went with the gambler jacket instead of some of their heavier gear jackets, because they do have those if you know you want to stay warmer and you want a heavier jacket. But the reason that I went with the gambler is because it is extremely lightweight. Um, you know, while it keeps you warm and it keeps the rain and the wind and all of that stuff off of you, it's really, really lightweight. So this is a jacket that I can bring along in the summertime uh, when I'm out fishing and it's really, really hot outside. But, you know, sometimes you get caught in some really bad rainstorms and you want to stay dry. So I can throw this on and it's not going to make me, you know, extremely hot and over there sweating under all of that. But I can stay dry, I can stay fishing even when, the, you know, the weather is, is warm. Uh, so that's why I went with this, the Gambler jacket. It's a lot lighter. It's just, it's just, you know, it's just a great jacket. I've talked about it before um, many, many times. I've, I, you know, those of you that have asked me uh, in person what I wear, well, this is it. It's Gambler jacket, the, the Grundens bibs, Grundens underliners. Yep, that's what you need. Those three things will, will keep you warm in the winter. It'll keep you uh, dry in the summer. Just a great, great alternative to layering up with tons and tons and tons of clothing and then being uncomfortable on the water. There we go. Completely warm, completely dry. Uh, wind isn't on me anymore. Just, you know, feels perfect out here now. Uh, but very, very minimal gear. I can stay completely warm, completely dry. And if it gets really, really cold, well, I can just put a sweater on underneath this. But beyond that, Grunt is also sells underliners, which I wear when I'm uh, wading in really cold temperatures. Um, I put those underliners on underneath my waders and I put my waders on. And I, I'm telling you, those underliners are extremely warm. Uh, in fact, you, sometimes you'll, uh, you'll take them off halfway through the day because you'll be sweating underneath that. They are very, very warm. But I will say this, they are extremely comfortable because I find myself wearing them more around the house than I do when I'm out fishing. Um, I, I just, I lounge around in them because they're comfortable. This is it, this is this is what I wear, stay completely warm. I've gone out with some people just over the last few weeks and they were all complaining about how miserably cold they were and they were layered up with all this stuff and I, I literally was wearing half of the clothing that they were and, and I was toasty. Uh, you know, it just feels good out there. You know, it comes with a hood so I can keep everything off of me, fits perfect. Yeah, staying warm. But anyway, I will post a link uh, to all of this gear uh, in the description below if you guys want to check it out. But um, there's another way to get it. See Anglers Anonymous here in Katy, uh, here in Houston. They they also sell all of this gear. They sell all of Grundens, and if there's something that they don't have, they can order it for you. Um, but yeah, all this gear you can get here locally, or you can order straight through Grundens, and it is just absolutely fantastic uh, for these colder months to keep you you know out of out of the uh out of the elements so all right guys well i'm i'm gonna head on home uh and actually get into uh you know into the house into a heater where um i don't have to wear any of this stuff so uh thank you guys for watching i do appreciate it if you haven't already please hit that subscribe button like the video comment below and we'll see you next time